New video tonight of what looks like a scene out of a movie. A gunman waves his weapon at a news photographer, and the man's camera was rolling the entire time. CBS 2's Tracy Carrasco shows us what happened next. I surrender my soul to God. A tearful confession caught on camera by a news photographer in Australia. Flagged down by the very man at the center of a shooting incident, the cameraman was on his way to cover. I just hope that she's all right. Uh, I think she's dead. With his hand still covered in blood, the suspect told the photographer he was the person police were looking for. The photographer kept up conversation with the suspect for 30 minutes after calling police twice. It's very important. It's extremely important. I have the person that you're looking for. I feel like a coward. You know, a coward. I, I couldn't fight. I couldn't fight the devil. But before police arrived, the suspect had a change of heart. That's when he jumped into the news van, pointed a gun at the cameraman, and took off. Don't be an idiot. Don't be a an idiot. Mate, don't be silly. Don't be silly. A dash cam mounted in the news van captured his wild getaway. The suspect crashed into a sign, then slammed into a gas tank and took off running as police moved in. And he just walked up to me purposefully. Uh, looked me in the eyes and asked me for a cigarette lighter. Now the man who normally reports the news is part of the story. I wanted to get the, that shot of him with the gun, but I didn't want to get shot. Officers took the suspect into custody. He may have been better off just surrendering to the news crew. He's now facing attempted murder and armed robbery charges as well. Maurice? Okay, Tracy, thank you.